Hi, Dorks. Hey, it's me. I'm on Chatter. We're here. Uh, how's game audio working? No, maybe. Maybe. No, oh, because I'm on the other tab. Whatever. Hi. <laughs> um, uh, we're here to play Sekiro. Continuing to play Sekiro. Uh, my blind playthrough. I've not played this game before, aside from, like, I guess this is episode six. So aside from the five episodes, this is all I've done. So yeah, this has been fun. Um, I'm excited to keep going today. I'm ex I'm. It's so nice outside. I <laughs> I wish I could stream outside or something. We have natural light coming in from the window. What the heck? That's not something we've really had before. Um, so I've, I've left the blinds kind of cracked there. There's like a, people can walk by the sidewalk and like look directly in. So I'm, I'm, I don't want to like leave it open. I've had the, the window itself open to like get a, to have a nice breeze, but I don't know. I don't want them all, I'm going to be all self-conscious if they can hear me. So the window's closed, blinds are open. Anyway, uh, the game is there maybe no i got it i gotta do the thing i gotta do it but where to go because it's a game capture not a window capture maybe there there okay <laughs> hooray um and how's this volume i have no idea where volume's at um, okay. Cool. I was briefly playing around with, um, the whole you, the whole setup. Um, it's kind of annoying to me that my picture covers the very last bit of my health bar. So I was trying to, like, flip it all over, but it wasn't as easy as I wanted it to be. So maybe next time, but, um,. Oh no, there's some health down there. Ah, uh, the main thing that we're gonna do today, fingers crossed, if I <laughs> is is uh, go after Genichiro or Genichiro. I don't know if it's a hard or a soft G. I'm being perfectly honest. I meant to Google that, and I didn't. Um, he's our main target for the day. Um, and I don't know if I don't know if I want to go straight into it. I'm not like warmed up or anything. Maybe I'll let's go. Let's go stab a couple of people just to get my oh I <laughs> I already stabbed a couple of people. Just to get my fingers working again. Yeah. How do you like that? The other two are just gonna come through here. Ah. Oop, oops. I'm not like, I need to be doing the deflect thing. <laughs> That's what I'm here for. Okay. Three at once is not the, the wisest. <laughs> there. That's the thing I really need to be good at. Like them both at once. <laughs> oh, come on. Getting backed into a corner is not great in this game. I guess it's not great in most games. Try it again. <laughs> okay. Jeez. What did that railing do to you? Yeah. 
there. Okay. Oh, this is the wrong way. Hello. Goodbye. <laughs> Um, I would love to have like a couple more skill points. I was kind of I was glancing briefly at, at our at all the stuff we have. Our builds and our, our skills and our weapons and stuff. Um I think this makes sense. The I I wanna try to poison him. Cause that seems smart. I'm gonna keep this. Um, what was the other thing I was thinking of? There's a skill. There's a skill that makes us take, like, less posture damage from swords, specifically. Um, but I think I need two more points in order to get that. Yeah, I have one and a half points. Um. I'm, I want to try this. I want to try to fight Gyobu. Just a little bit. Um, we've already killed Gyobu once, but this is the, the Reflection of Strength version, which means I, he's more powerful, I guess. I don't really know all the details of how this works, um, but he's definitely stronger than the first time we saw him. It's Gyobu Masataka Oniwa! As I breathe, you will not pass the castle gate! It's so loud, I need to turn my volume down again. Yep. He hits hard. He hits real hard. <laughs> I Oh, one. You're still standing. I'll strike you as many times as it takes. Come on. So, really? He's got the reach, that's for sure. didn't surprise me I just I just afflicted a split second too late okay um so lose a bunch of junk we have we have some money I'm so I we were running out of emblems so I'm gonna spend my money on emblems when I can to try and get them into our what should we call it? Into our storage? I'm also gonna turn my volume down a little. Uh tell him tell me if your volume's too loud. Your game volume's too loud. I can never tell. Yeah, I really don't know. <laughs> my name is Kyobu Masa! Move in haste and die, brat! Onikage, die! I'm curious if me going up into the air and hitting him does anything. Like if that does more damage or something. Oh, 
hole. Oh, he's standing. Wind-ups are so freaking long. Yes, yes, come on. Oh, you're still standing. I'll strike you as many times as it takes. Gonna sit there and let me do it. That's fine. Wee -hee -hee. There we go. There's one. Oh, I didn't ever actually see his face. You will not take this Kyobu's head. Took the other Kyobu's head. The range close. of, like, the, the, the grappling hook has a very specific range. You can be too far and you can be too close. Okay, let's do one more of those. I'm not sure if, we're not really losing our XP, are we? Interesting. I mean, I'll take it. Okay. For real this time. My name is Kyobu Masataka Oniwa! Onikage, Kyobu! Hey, you finally got me with that one. See all oh, the freaking <laughs> little scrap of fabric in the way. You're still standing. I'll strike you as many times as it takes. Beat him. That's why it's frustrating. Okay. Well, we know what we must do. Do what must be done. Hello, Genichiro. Face me, Shinobi. I don't think I'd see you again. I'll have to remember all your junk. This, that's the thing I really need to do. This. That. And there's that. Twice in a row. Ha! Ha ha ha! Okay. You're not finished yet. There's no need to find it. Three times in a row. 
My neurons have done their thing. <laughs> Second phase, he doesn't always do that. <laughs> Wasn't quite the opportunity I thought it was. That's our That's our best phase one. Shinobi of the Divine Air. Would you deserve better? Would you not answer to a different lord? Heresy. <laughs> well, what heresy kind of heresy? And if it is for the sake of preserving Ashina. I will seize any manner of heretical strength. I will endure the lightning burden. time. Hooray. Behold the lightning of Tomoe. It's so cool. Okay. Now all we gotta do is jump when he's doing his lightning stuff. He's gonna come lunge, right? The instinct of to dodge is so strong. Jumping. I was jumping. Okay. We could do phase one. Hopefully that wasn't like my, my beginner's luck of the day. Uh, now we lost XP. Okay. Here we are, grinding bosses. Face me. Shinobi, I didn't think I'd see you again. sucks.
Dang, okay, there's one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. Oh, 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 come on. Come on. He's just gonna sit there and get his posture back, of course. Cool, cool. You can get him without dying. Twice in a row, even. Okay. Come at me! So hi, migrating pigeon. That's a great name. Hello. I have every intention of beating this guy today. I spent a lot of time on him last stream. So hopefully all the muscle memories have solidified. I mean, I beat phase one two out of two already, so maybe that's that's a good sign. Just need to. Just need to Face deflect me. the lightning, that's Shinobi. all. I didn't think I'd see you again. Okay. Oh, not quite close enough. Nope, nope. 
Everything's great until it isn't. I gotta block that one. Hurl. Yeah, I believe it. Impressive. I mean, you should, should have seen a uh, divine air. Long arm centipede. <laughs> yeah. Need to like not avoid it. No, not the grab. Oh. Always with the grab. <laughs> That? No, that wasn't it. That wasn't quite it. Yep, yep. The power of the dragon's blood. Kill you as many times as it takes. Awesome. I, need, I wish I could practice the lightning bit. I actually caught the lightning, didn't do the redirect. Did I? Okay, I didn't see the prompt. Does the... Does the... Like the first time I did it, it was like, press RB right now. Does it do that every time or do I have to like, do I have to know? <laughs> I've only, I've only successfully redirected once. No, only the first time, of course. Okay. So I was looking for the, I was looking for the button prompt. Face me. Miyazaki expects more of me. Phase one without healing. That's that's something, right? <laughs> now just not just don't get owned, that's all. Don't get grabbed. That's the main thing. Yes. Ooh. 
Oh, I got a good. There's one more button. <laughs> oh, at least. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Cool. Wow. That's a boss fight. Thank you. I'm gonna give myself a little clap on that one. That's not, not a... That one wasn't a gimme. Oh, okay. That only took me three or four tries. I spent... So I was going through and putting like in the, the chapter codes in, in the previous episode, and I spent well over an hour on that guy last time, so... Very satisfying. Battle memory of an extraordinary foe. Immune with a sculptor's idol, yes, yes. As the code dictates, the wolf swore vengeance on Genichiro Ashina. Blood smoke ninjutsu. Oh. Turns the spraying blood of a victim into smoke. Costs spirit emblems. Activated after a death blow. Smokescreen allows ones to retake the element of surprise. Life or death, the struggle defines a shinobi for whom a kill is a source of strength. Wow. Because our stealth needed to get more busted. Ninjutsu. Sweet. Powerful abilities that can be used after performing a backstab death blow, specifically. Okay. Must be equipped in the equipment. Oh, is that other slot? That's the other slot, isn't it? How many, got, how many points did we get? I want a cutscene. All sorts of things. Is the child you here? Victorious. There you are. I see. No, that's Emma. <laughs> are you? I mean you no harm. <laughs> Shinobi of the Divine A- Cool it, Wolf. We've already met this person. Lord Kenichiro. Is this the rejuvenating force? See? Yeah, that's what I was wondering. <sighs> Zombie lightning samurai. Oh, this land is everything to me. For her sake. I will shed humanity itself. Yeah. Resurrection. Yes. Go. Indeed. Stab in the back right now. <laughs> so. uh, knew it. Knew it. No, there's no way he's just going to die right here. The tutorial boss does not go down easy. I know that much. Ooh. Okay. He's... <laughs> uh, only one slot. Yeah, okay. I have a ninjutsu slot. RB after... Okay. Cool. I'm excited about that. Um, and two points. I want a third point. That's what I want. What do what do the remnants have to say? Confront parasite. <laughs> okay. Hi. At long last, I've managed to fulfill my master's orders. I give you my thanks. Who exactly? Uh, that's what I was going to serve. Ishin Ashina. Huh. I am a doctor. Mm -hmm in the service of Lord Ishin. Why were you ordered to help me? Lord Ishin has no desire to use the power of the dragon's heritage. That is why he... He tried to help Lord Kuro escape Ashina. Correct. The message I found in the well, that was your doing? Also correct. <laughs> My duties have concluded, but there's someone I think you'd like to see, Lord Kuro. Is downstairs. 
there's someone, Lord Kuro. Okay. Another idol right here? Okay. Strange. Take it, I guess. Hello, child. I have come for you, my lord. Yes, you did well to come here. Let us go. We must leave Ashina. Wolf, my blood. The blood of the dragon causes men to become undying. Yeah, it's great. The same goes for you. Yes, my lord. I wished to save you. <laughs> I'm sure that I would do the same thing given another chance. However, undying begets stagnation. Mm. The immortal oath, the rejuvenating waters, the dragon rot, they all corrupt men to the point that they no longer live as men. I wish to sever the chains of stagnation bred by the dragon's heritage. Wolf, will you help me achieve hmm. this aim? Hmm. I mean, we're saying Father, yes, because that's how these games work, but... I cannot break the Iron Code. Huh. Interesting. Father, I cannot break the Iron Code. I cannot. To protect you, the divine heir. That was the duty my father entrusted to me. How many times are mutually exclusive you though? and come back to life for my sake? Two? Three times? Or perhaps <laughs> a number so large that it cannot be counted? As it was for the purpose of defending my lord, the number does not matter. I do not wish to bind you to an eternity of undeath, wolf. Join me in my quest to sever the ties of immortality. As you wish. Thank you, loyal wolf. Yeah, I mean, if if he's gonna go do a thing and we have to protect him, then we're all along for the ride, right? Did they give you a choice and then I'll let you choose? Yeah, basically. The first option was like, yes, I'll do what you ask. And then wolf is like, no, I can't do that. That breaks an oath. So then you have to choose the other option. That's not too... Uh, surprising considering these games um, the more the more typical thing is like a person will ask you hey do you want to like jump off this cliff and the answer will be yes or no and the no answer like you can say no but then the dialogue ends and then nothing happens so you have to like do the stupid thing you have to say yes to whatever the NPC wants to progress the quest even if it means you do something really really stupid that's usually how it works you have more to say if we are seeking to sever the immortal ties, I know a good place to start. Wolf, look at this. Immortal severance text. You found a handbook for... Fine. <laughs> a book from Kuro on the art of severing ties with the dra dragon's heritage. It looks old. Binding is torn. Several pages are missing. I'm sure those pages aren't important. Heron describes the means to perform... The right of immortal severance. Beyond the Fountainhead Palace, locate the sanctuary and imbibe the tears of the holy dragon of the divine realm. Without ruining your stream, can you explain what the hell is going on? Yeah. Um. It's an ancient record that was kept in Ashina Castle. Sacred dragon tears from the divine realm. Yes. It is my belief that with the Dragon Tears, it may be possible to sever the Dragon's heritage. But... the Divine Realm? Yeah. What, How do we... what does that mean? I know. Wolf, that incense burner over there, it belonged to a... person of interest. Take a look. Okay. Um, I mean, what's going on is kind of like actively developing in this conversation this is a major this is kind of a major plot point um we spent the first half of the game trying to rescue Corporal here um we we don't know the full story so it's being told through uh like flashbacks and um and like dialogue and that kind of stuff um and that's very typical with these kinds of games we don't know the full story wolf the, our player character doesn't know the full story he doesn't remember everything that happened before um but we are a shinobi. 
our, our duty is to protect this child. He's the divine heir, and he is supernatural in the sense that he can... Basically, if you enter an oath in, enter into an oath with this child, he can use his divine protection to resurrect you. So, Kuro has bound to us, and that is and that's like the in-universe reason why we can die and come back. Like, dying is not really a game over in these kinds of games. Dying is like your character dies and then comes back canonically, and Kuro is the reason why we can do that. Um, the guy who we just fought upstairs also wanted to enter into an oath with Kuro so that he could be immortal. So apparently he can just... He's immortal anyway. Or no, he wanted he wanted Kuro's resurrective power to save his grandfather, Ishin, who's um, ruler? I don't know what his official title is, uh, but he's the, the ruler of Ashina. So Denichiro wanted to use the child's divinity to save his dying grandfather, basically. Uh, but we killed him. We saved Kuro. Kuro was, like, captured here for, like, the first half of the game, so we got here, finally. Um, and now Kuro was telling us that his divinity, his his supernatural powers to resurrect people, he's... he wants none of it. He wants to, to stop it. Um, so... We're gonna help him, because <laughs> that's how these games work. And Is we'll, there something special about it? We'll find I out more about ago, what all that means as we there go. There was another divine heir yeah, living okay. here in Ashina Castle. His name was Lord Takeru. That's the first I'm hearing of that name. This belonged to him. Where is he now? Dead. He died a long yeah. time ago, apparently. Wrapped in the aroma of the fountainhead, I returned to the divine realm. Hmm. Those are supposedly the words he left behind. You're saying the scent of the fountainhead is the key to reaching the divine realm. The fountainhead has that been mentioned a lot, belief. too, as being a divine Wolf, thing. Let us discover the truth together. Interesting. Oh, that's cool looking. Oh, let me... Let me look at it. Oh, come on. <laughs> now, as to how we begin our search... I am certain some of Lord Takeru's books remain in this castle. Probably. Books that he collected in order to find the Divine Realm. I will search for them. In addition to finding a way to reach the Divine Realm, might we also look into how we might sever the immortal ties? A fine suggestion. Talk to Ishin. If anyone knows the answer, is he it just, is him. He's just here? Wolf, come with me. Slowly. <laughs> that wasn't far. Lord Ishin is not within this castle okay. citadel. I'm told he is recuperating in one of these watchtowers. However, the path to his watchtower is closed. Mm -hmm. His health is a little... How do I get in? On the roof. There's a path patrolled by the Nightjar Ninja. It's intended for Shinobi. But I imagine that won't be a problem for you. I've heard the Nightjar use smoke signals mm -hmm. as landmarks. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's how yes. I got here in the first place. So if you follow their smoke signals, you should be able to reach okay. Lord Ishin. And you can use this window to reach the roof. Okay. Find Lord Ishin. And at he's recuperating and won't reach the roof from that open window. Then fly and trust. We haven't, we haven't talked directly with Ishin. I'm kind of, I, I don't quite have a read on his role, or I guess his, um, whether or not he likes us, <laughs> whether or not he's a good guy. Uh, but I guess we're going to go find him and talk to him, so maybe that'll answer some questions there. Is this, oh, hey, look, I can just open a window. How oh, novel. Cool. So yeah, these smoke signals, we want to follow these. This is where this is where we were. Perfect. So we Let's 
We've been into a lot of these places. I'm curious which... Which watchtower we're talking about. Because there are several. We've been over there. We've been in both these directions. But I haven't been inside most of these. Here? Oh, is he just right here? Hello. I was expecting About that to be a little divine hard. Heir's life. Yes? There is something I wish to ask. Uh, before that, Saki. What? You earned it. Oh. Thank you. <laughs> Thought he was demanding it. <laughs> okay, cool. One of his favorites. Okay. My grandson, Genichiro, was bewitched by the rejuvenated That's the guy we just killed. Not killed, but... You did well to put a stop to that for me. You have my thanks. I merely You're followed welcome. the code my father taught me. Ah, the Iron Code of the Shinobi. I see. So you're the son of Owl. That boy he found during the rebellion. Yes. That's me. And your travels brought you here. <laughs> the bonds that tie us are so deeply amusing. <laughs> what do you think, Sekiro? You're... So what do you wish to know? Oh, there's only one other person in this game who's called us Sekiro. Interesting. That's interesting. Okay. So Sekiro, Sekiro is the name of the game, but Sekiro isn't our name. Our our character's name is Wolf, um, as far as we can tell, or as far as he's ever been called in the game. Um, but we met another guy, a Tengu. He had a mask on, and he was super tall and super skinny. Uh, we met him outside the gate of the castle, um, and he gave us a little quest, and, and we came back to him, and he was, he was real friendly. But he's the one who started calling us Sekiro. Apparently, apparently Ishin is not, um, either not as sick as he appears, or leading a double life, or, I don't know. I mean, there's the more going on. The divine heir's apparently. desire is to sever the ties of immortality. I want to know how it can be done. The mortal blade. If you had such a weapon, it may be the key to what you are after. The mortal blade? With it, you could kill one who cannot die through normal means. One who cannot die. Everyone infested, in this game? Yeah. I believe they are called. I have not seen one before, but it's said you could stab them through the heart or remove their head and they wouldn't die. We fought a headless thing. <laughs> If the stories are true, <laughs> and have not beaten it, be quite fearsome. Mm. To kill a monster such as that, you'd need the mortal blade. Okay. Where is this Yo. mortal <laughs> blade? I've heard it's held in Sempo Temple. Okay. However, they say the mortal blade cannot be drawn. What do you mean? I am not certain of the meaning. It's just hearsay. Hmm. The gates to that temple are closed now, though. Who knows what those degenerates are doing shut away up there in the mountains. Not good there things. There aren't We've any been decent there. roads leading there. Okay. Well, we've done... So we spent, like, an entire stream in the at the Senpao Temple. And I don't... Do I give it to him or do I give it to the... I'll... Here, take it. Here. Are you... Offering me the sake yes. I gave you. <laughs> Delightful. I'll take it. Probably another person we can give that to, too. <sighs> That's the stuff. By the way, how was Ganishiro? What do you mean? You he two sucked. crossed blades, did you not? Uh -huh. To put it simply, he was strong. Yes. And he had unusual techniques. Herbetical techniques? See. What exactly is the Lightning of Tomoe? <laughs> that oh, that. is a technique belonging to Genichiro's mentor. I'll wager it was quite the sight. His mentor? Tomoe. There aren't many masters of the sword Where? like her. To see her fight, it's like she's dancing. When you look into her eyes, he 
You feel as if you're being drawn into the depths she's of the still, ocean. She's alive? She's around here somewhere? I was completely taken by her, and it almost killed me. <laughs> I've lived a long life, but that was the closest I've come to death. Hmm. You're leaving, Sekiro. Severing immortality. That will be quite the battle. And in battle, the plans and desires of those involved churn endlessly. If you hesitate, you'll be swept away. And lose the battle. <laughs> That's right. Best you keep it in mind. Sekiro, hesitate. And you lose. Sekiro, what is it you wish to learn? Anything else? No. You're leaving, okay. Sekiro. Another time. Cool. Well then. He's... Just... Cool, I guess? Though... There's clearly more going on. Is he... Okay. I know where I am. So I've literally been through here. This is how I got up there in the first place, but I don't think he was there the first time. Can I just... Hello? Oh, really? Yeah, get away from me. Get away from me. He should not help me. Your boys are hurting me. This this ain't me. I'm hiding. Okay. Um. Well, we can go talk to Kuro again. Maybe he has something to say now. All we've all we really learned is that. thing we really want is in Senpo Temple. Teasing. So you've oh, met think. with Lord Ishin? Yes. He thanked me for, for defeating Genichiro. Beating up his grandson. <laughs> to think that Lord Genichiro would go as far as to drink the rejuvenating sediment. Sediment. Rejuvenating sediment. That's what we call a particularly concentrated part of the rejuvenating waters. Huh. I'm sure you saw it for yourself. The rejuvenating sediment grants great resilience in one's flesh. One becomes able to withstand blows that would be fatal to anyone else. Three of them My even. mentor Dogen devoted much research to its uses, but all of his works, documents, medicines, everything were burned and destroyed. I'm not sure who, but I heard one of the senior apprentices was able to salvage some of it. <laughs> Probably Dojun. I don't know that name. Did you ask Lord Kuro's thoughts on the matter? I did. And? We've decided to sever the ties of immortality. I see. I thank you for all <laughs> the help you've given me. <laughs> Almost sounds like you're bidding me farewell for good. I've carried out my lord's orders, so I will stay here in the castle. Come and speak to me whenever you please. I will provide my assistance to you as a doctor. Well, that's good, because she's the one who upgrades our Master healing Wolf, flask. It looks as if your brow is less furrowed than before. Mm -hmm. If only a little. Hmm. Please. See that Lord Kuro's wish to sever immortality is met. Goodbye. Okay. Reed, Wolf, found something. I've opened the library. Meet me there. Uh, where's that? Uh, this is interactable. Oh, a thing. Magnetite. Still so much dust.
Uh, where are you? Oh, I saw a secret door. Nothing. Oh, there he is. Gunfort Shrine Key. Excellent. We've been to the Gunfort. Key to a shrine deep within the Gunfort. The gate behind the shrine's idol is made to be opened. Oh, we've even beat the boss that's in front of it. Perfect. Sunken Valley Clan will shoot any stranger who approaches, and the Snake Eyes gun... Snake Eyes' gun are particularly feared. Elite group of women are descendants of the ancient Okami clan. Their especially sharp eyes allow them to snipe victims from great range. Sure can. That was a fun sequence. Um... Okay. This is the library. A little sad. Awful. I have returned. Oh, Wolf, you're back. Did you meet with Lord Ishin? <laughs> I did. He said the mortal blade, it could be the key to severing immortality. The mortal blade? It's a sword that has the power to kill the undying. It can be found at Senpo Temple. I see. Yes, that seems promising. I agree. As you say. For my part, I hunted for any books that may contain clues about the aroma of the Fountainhead. <laughs> it seems Lord Takeru indeed sought a way to reach the Divine Realm. So far, I found one piece of relevant information. What is it? A flower. A flower? First, read this. A note from Kuro, written by Takeru, former heir. Uh, it is said that relatives of Tomoe once gathered the Fountainhead fragrance and arrived at the palace. You may find a key where the waters of rejuvenation converge in a deep pool, a white and deeply fragrant, fragrant flower. Interesting. So we need... So there's going to be a flower that has the scent of the Fountainhead that we will use in the incense burner, and that will what take us to the divine Lord room. Lord Takeru left it behind. I was looking for information on the fountainhead aroma, and how it relates to the divine realm. There is water that flows from the fountainhead through Ashina, and the book speaks of a white lotus flower that grows where the water pools deeply. It appears to be one component of the oh. fountainhead aroma. Mm, component is great. where the fountainhead waters pool deeply. Perhaps in a deep valley? Yes, indeed. The sunken, sunken valley, valley may the be gun the fort. place. The fountainhead water should flow into there. Where is this sunken valley? You've been it's there, beyond the Wolf. woods to the rear of the castle. There's a shrine dedicated to the white serpent deep in the woods. As the name implies, the sunken valley is just below that place. You did things out of order. There's no proper path down there. <laughs> oh well. But a man of your talent could navigate it. Uh, and then this. My lord, this is for you. Could this be? It's a Sakura droplet. That's... When the undying pledge of the dragon's heritage is broken, it's said that this remains in place of the oath. Do you think this one was left behind by Lord Takeru? That seems likely. Wolf, if you so desire, I can use this Sakura droplet to Ooh. assist you. If you should be so kind. Shh. Of course. Sure. Close your eyes. My lord. Lord Takeru's dragon blood lives on with you. That gives me another resurrective charge, I think. I humbly accept. Yes. Hopefully this process isn't like painful or something. You may open your eyes now. <laughs> My lord. No, I'm blind! Additional resurrective power granted. That cool. was a boon. Granted by Lord Takeru. Use it well. Yes. Okay. My lord, this is for you. This is a document written by one who sought the fountainhead aroma. Mm, I see. Must have found this before. It says there's a fragrant stone, fragrant stone. in some sacred village. I've never heard of such a village. It is beneath Ashina. Now that you mention it, 
about the well near the Moonview mm. Tower. I've read it may have some connection with the bottomless hole. This may be worth investigating. It's all the way back at the beginning. I will take a look. Good. The text did say to throw oneself. I wonder what that could mean. I do not know. <sighs> that was strange. I don't know either. See if you can think of a place. My lord. I think we're missing uh, missing oh, a bit of information that's there. that's right. That door marked with the outline of a person. Yeah, yeah. Lord Ishin once called it a shinobi shortcut. I haven't a clue how it works, but seeing as he mentioned Shinobi, I thought you might know. I'll show you. You just go like this. Not that hard. Now we're somewhere else. I have no idea where we are now. We're back in, oh my goodness. So this game has fast travel. So all these, um, all these little save points, we can travel from save point to save point. But that was, so this is our, this is our hideout. This is our hub. This is the guy who upgrades our stuff. That's how Emma got here to there. There was a secret passage from the, the castle to... Oh my goodness. And Kuro was behind the door the whole time. If we could have just gone through the, sort, the shortcut the other way, we would have found Kuro at the very beginning of the game. But of course, that's not how shortcuts work. Oh. Hello. Oh, here. Need something? The Divine Heir. <laughs> you found him. saved him. That has nothing to do with me. It does. You have my thanks. The guy who gave us our mm. prosthetic arm. The shadow in your eyes. It's become a shade lighter. <laughs> what? No matter. So, you need something. I don't know if I can upgrade it at all. I don't have anything new. No. Upgrade. Hmm. Yeah, we need a lot more materials. Another time. Okay. Yeah, this is like this is the very beginning, and I've known like this door has been here this whole time. But you go, you go up to it, and it's like you can't open it from this side. I went to the middle of the castle the whole time. My God. I must ascertain the secret to the aroma of the yes. fountainhead. I will tell you what I've... Ah, new there. Did you notice the lingering scent in the incense burner? No, I did not. I see. Then I suggest you do so at some point. It is faint, yet it makes you feel as though there is still some of the aroma left. Hmm. Faintly of sakura flowers. My lord, the incense burner. You smelled it? What did you think? Did you deal with it? The smell was reminiscent of sawdust, but also it smelled faintly of sakura flowers. Oh, so you smelled it too. I felt the scent was much like sakura flowers, but slightly different. Hmm. Hmm. What is it, Wolf? That scent. It reminds me of something. You've smelled it before. I believe so. But I can't remember where. Now that you mention it, Lady Emma said that once long ago, there was a sakura tree to the rear of the <laughs> castle. Perhaps that is relevant to our search. Interesting. Well, the key we got is a much more obvious <laughs> line of inquiry. Um, yeah, so we could just travel to Sunken Valley, Gunfort. We've already done this whole sequence. There's a scary boss in here and everything. We took care of it. 
open. Use the key. Perfect. Where the heck does this put us? Sunken Valley Passage. Interesting. So now we're in a whole new area. Cool. Was kind of running out of new paths to go down, so here we are. Uh. Oh! Hello, friend. Forgot about him. Uh. Oh! Nope! Oh! We're still. We're still in danger. Still. Uh, I can't, like, I can't go under the water. For context, we have seen this snake before, but and we stabbed it in the eye, but then the sequence ended without us killing it. So we've been waiting for it to come back this whole time. I do. Where's he? Can I get out? Mm, I... So I don't think I can dive. At least not presently. Um. Oh. Okay, okay, uh... Just gotta dodge. Just gonna dodge things. Okay, cool. Oh. No, I'll just... I'll just... I'll just sneak. I'll just... I'll just run. Fine, okay. Ooh. 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 You can't hit me. You can't hit me while I'm resting. <laughs> okay. Uh, there's gonna be a whole sequence of this. I can guarantee it. Had a mantite scrap. Cool. That's an upgrade component. Uh, anything else that I missed? There was a ladder. Okay. Wee. Okay. Snake. What do you mean you can't? There. <laughs> oh, big statues. Hi. Monkeys. That monkey has a hat. That monkey has a hat. All the way down there. Hello. Something sees me. I'm just going down. Oh! What's. Is that. That monkey's got a gun! Come back here! Monkey with a gun! <laughs> oh, there's another one. That is not what I was expecting. Oh, hi. Why do the monkeys have guns? Exciting. <laughs> cool. Um... I'm gonna make sure to scour all these corners. They like to hide things. Uh, 
Hello. That felt mean. <laughs> okay. I'd feel bad, but they'd do the same to me. Okay. There's something there. That's a lot of statues. Too high. There we go. Hard to know how far you can fall. Oh, hi. Oh, there's a bunch of them. They're not strong. Oh. Nope. Was. <laughs> have to reload. <laughs> so dumb. A monkey loading a little musket. <laughs> oh, these things. We like these. Back to these dudes. What's behind me? The gun keys, yeah. <laughs> That's a lot of monkeys. I don't have my I don't have my telescope handy. That goes way down. We're gonna end up down there. We've been there. That's a lot of monkeys. Um, here. I have a thing that does a little bit of AoE. I can't sneak up on them, right? Can I sneak by them? I wonder. Yes. Do I want to? Well, then we're... We're definitely going down. I mean, we knew that. We wanted to find the low point. Hi, friends. <laughs> I'll just... Just start stabbing. So anyway, I started stabbing.
Oh, my. Oh, some of them still have guns. You got a gun. You got a gun. Stop it. I wanted a sword. Okay. That's a lot of monkeys. Come on. About the thing that gives me just a little bit of health back every time I do a death blow. It's been. That's pretty good. Free health. Perfect. Monkey booze. Who wanted monkey booze? Someone wanted monkey booze. Or no, we found monkey booze. And we gave it to our prosthetic guy. We should give him some more. He seemed to like all the booze. That all that was here. That's little little things. Um, I guess we're going across this. Oh hi! Is this the same lady? Ah, uh, fruit. Of the serpent, the yes. Lady. There are two kinds. One is fresh, the other is dried. Over there, the dried fruit is over mm -hmm. there, past the poison swamp. The Down poison the swamp. nest, that's where you'll find it. What are you talking about? Dried fruit? Eh? Something troubling you? Rice. She wants for rice. Me. Yep. That's the way. Rice, I say. If something's not right, bless me with rice any time. <clears throat> Have any rice Don't guide me. from the divine child? You didn't give me any rice last time. Um, so we've seen her once before, and she told us about the fresh fruit, and she pointed to it. Well, that's interesting, and that's like nowhere near here. Or we can see, so we don't have a real map. Um, we have a this kind of map. Um, so we're we're over here in the sunken valley. We saw her over at Senpo Temple. So yeah, that's not that close. Also, the other place we need to go. But yeah, we're we're gonna have to fight the giant snake in the poison swamp. Cool. I unfortunately know what that is. I don't know most things in this game. There are a couple things that I know, just from from having been spoiled for you know just seeing things around, people talking about things. Um, I think I know what this one is. Maybe we're like, we're like way overpowered for it. Yeah, look at all these. We're gonna be uh, swinging. Hello, friend. Nope. Not friend. 
Guardian 8. Oh boy. Oh boy. He's big. Oh, we can grab onto him. Sometimes. Good. Wow. Well, then what status is that? Is he poisoning? Grabbing? Neat. That sucks. Sword room already. He, like sits down. And I'm poisoned. Have your little tantrum. <laughs> Dude. Nope, not to grab. Got it. And we can't res again. Hmm. Be a grabby boy. Oh, and now we're doing this again. Okay. Two of them right in a row. Okay. Uh, we almost have a third point. I don't want to. I want to lose my XP points before getting a third point. And it seemed like we went down here. Oh, ho, 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 ho. oh boy. Yeah, that looks pretty gross. I'm gonna go over there. Wherever that is. Poison swamps. Is it a goopy poison swamp? It's a goopy poison swamp. Get out. Okay. Money. I guess that's worth it. These are trees, yes. Come on. Get up. Okay. We oh, okay. And we're just we're just doing this, okay. Poison swamps are a little bit easier when you can grapple hook. Couldn't quite reach that one. Oh, 
shop. They really do kind of hide. <laughs> oh, this is a merchant. An offering. Another one. Where you find the departed, you find the memorial mob. Even in places where people simply drift along. <laughs> Go ahead. Buy an offering. You got a gourd. Moss covered gourd filled with medicinal water refills upon rest. While it does not while it does not heal poison status, it reduces poison buildup and increases poison resistance. This gourd was made out of necessity by those that made poisonous lands their home. It said if you live there long enough, eventually poison won't affect you at all. Interesting. Very expensive. 1800, we could probably do that. Because these are worth 500 a piece. So if we do three of these. And then two. 1800, right? Yeah. Hey, you there. Don't go into that cave up ahead. So we're going into the Inside cave. Inside is an old shrine Ooh. where the serpent god dwells. And if the serpent god swallows you, <laughs> you can't buy any more offerings Fair point. now, can you? <laughs> where you find wherever your travels take you, may. <laughs> Okay, so I want to put that on my bar. Um, I do still like the pellets. Nasifying agent, let's do contact medicine is for poison. And then the candy that reduces damage taken. Yeah, why not? Okay, so the snake is down there. Cool. Right. I want to go up there. Sorts of goodies. Uh oh. Monkeys. Scarier monkeys. Yeah, the one with the two swords is gonna be a problem, isn't it? Got a beard and everything. That's cool. Oh, guns. gun at someone in a sword fight. It's very, very rude. <laughs> very rude. Sometimes I can be sneaky. No, not quite. I need to get rid of all these. Did it just blow up on him? Come on. Oh, 
Nope, not into the poison, please. Okay, hope my res. Yes. Didn't think I could do that again, did you? Monkey got moves. Cool. Uh, that's gonna put me back way back up top. Yeah. Great. And then I lose all that XP. Um. Okay. I'm gonna be right back. We're gonna take a just a thirty second BRB, I think. Um. And then we'll do more of that. So I'll I'll just be I'll be right back. That's whatever. Break time over. <laughs> okay. Um, we have, oh, we have um, little five charges. Very nice. If I do this, I have, I have a bulletproof umbrella that I'm going to use against the ninja monkeys, and that's a fun sentence. <laughs> Luckily, we've gotten a lot of the goodies around here, I think, so we can just kind of go forward. We are here. Is this where you usually are? Or is there more than one? One on one, you're probably fine. What's the matter? Can you hit me? Whoop, whoop. Got the water. Whoop. Oh, yeah. Water's bad. <laughs> um, I want to do this. Good sign. Is this just a this is just a normal elite enemy now? Or is this a specific dude? That's what I'm curious about. Nope. Come on. Really? Ugh. 
Me, <laughs> buddy. Upgrade component, that's good at least. My goodness. Now I'm curious, that other one's still over here, right? that do for me? Is there a... Is this something else, or is this just a way back up? Oh, hi. He was kind of just chilling, but, you know. There's a thing. This... Okay. Consumable. Okay. I feel like we're getting back up to where... Yeah, there's all the monkeys. just still here. Definitely need to get rid of all these <laughs> friends first. Or just, you know, grab whatever he's guarding. <laughs> nope, I was trying to trying to leave. <laughs> you're not gonna you're not gonna give me a second, are you? Yeah. 
Yeah? What'd your AI think about this, huh? so hard. Fine. I don't want to play with you anyway. You following? No. Okay. Is there anything else here? Or is this just... Can see it. There. <laughs> it's still just over there. Okay. I don't think there's any other goodies. There we go. Of course, now I'm at like zero health refills. And enter into some ridiculous boss sequence, aren't I? That one's good sign. Oh, out of the walls. Okay. Uh, what? What? Hey, little friends. See it. There's its head. It's just just passing through here. This is nothing. Oh boy. Oh, this is not going to be good. Must be far enough away that it can't hear us, at least. No, the walls just hit us. Okay. Could I have gone the other way? I guess I could have just gone around this way. That wouldn't do anything for me. Concerned about these little geyser shaped things. Are these the ones I've already been here. I got all turned around, didn't I? Okay. 
And then we can go under here. Dude, the walls. Can I even hit you? They're just gonna, yeah, they're not gonna wait around for me to do that. Nope, not that way. Can I... Excuse me? Hmm. <laughs> oh. Okay. Whoops. Whoops. Okay. Uh oh. Uh-oh. This looks, um... Climactic. Sneaking, is there? I'm just running in, yeah, and then running past. Okay. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Noted. I have to go all the way back. All those XP points we got for killing the monkeys. Very cool. We should be able to just get back there. In theory. Okay. I wish I had a lantern or something. That'd be pretty cool. I think sneaking doesn't really do us much in here, considering the walls can just reach out and stab us at any time. I do. I went this way? Yeah. Like, oh, God. Okay. And then... I tried. I tried. I tried. I tried. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Well, I saw the other guy just run past. Clearly, it's possible. No, oh, thank you. This isn't so hard. Oh, 
So we go down here. There's a there's a hook point there. There we go. Hi monkey. Yeah, this is the smart way. Still... Is that smarter? I mean, it probably is, but you still have to dodge at least once. Okay. This that's a little slightly faster. Oh, excuse me. like make myself temporarily invisible or something right oh there was actually there is a thing impart in human benediction well let's try it i think he's just gonna detect me no matter what i do yeah well, cool. Like, there's, like, there's no... There's no room for button presses in there. You have to say. Okay. <laughs> no, no more insight. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Oh, well, they don't want me getting back out. That's for sure. What are you? Dried serpent viscera. The dried fruit. That's what the lady was talking about. I thought it was her the snake skin or something. Dried persimmon-like heart of a great serpent. The great serpent is a god of the land, and the heart is believed where one spirit resides. While it looks much like a persimmon, in fact, this is the red viscera of a god. Cool. Apparently, denizens of the sunken valley worship the organs, believing they represent the deity itself. Cool. That's what I was here for. I don't know what that does for me. I 
Maybe I can just bring it to that lady. Um, you're just... Okay. <laughs> um, none of these are false walls, I think. They're like up. There we go. It's always up. There's always more up. Also some down. Ooh, divine confetti. We need that. Ashina Adepts. We haven't been here. And another waypoint. Cool. Okay. More seeing the serpent and not killing the serpent. I don't think these are friends. You just are a dude with a gun. Oh, what do you got me through a wall? You Kick and then the shot. That's right. There's like a oh, there's a guy up there that I haven't beaten. Remembering uh, remembering another person who does the exact same thing. Okay. Okay. And then we keep going up that way, I guess. Oh, there's someone. I get you first. Ooh, 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 ooh. Snake eyes. Shirahagi. I think that's the one down there. Yeah, Jesus. Oh, it's not quite what I meant. Okay. What? <laughs> okay, there was someone else that I didn't know about. This or a demon gorilla? I said that's a choice. Okay. You, come over here. Fight me over here. Hey. Yeah, come on. Come on. This is 
isn't even the boss. It's just another dude. Probably him, yeah. I was holding block. Ugh. Yeah, that's the boss. Nonsense. Okay, well, that strikes me as a keep on running kind of a situation. Is there something back here? Oh, he's there. Okay. Oh, <laughs> I can't leave. allowed and grab and grab the thing at least oh come on Try just there. And then oh, that's <laughs> oh, and another thing. Okay, cool, 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 cool. There's just a, a boss that's gonna stay down there. We should go back and fight some of the ones we skipped at some point. There's a boss behind us that's got the same move set, but probably lower level. Something over there too. There's there's all sorts of stuff in there. Ugh. And then what? And then there's nothing else here? Really? Why? What is this sculpture called? Caution of Depths. What's the significance of here? I mean, it would let me... I can do this. That's cool, right? I can see it already sees me. So hard. 
And I'm poisoned. That's fine. Run back here real quick. What's, what's this one called? Poison pool. I guess that makes sense. <laughs> Better luck next time. Okay. I want to go up there. Oh. Oil. It's not. And up here. And then you're gonna tell me to jump across, right? Or not. Oops, whoops, whoops. It's still going at it. Come on. Come on. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know how to get up there. Dude. Not that I know where he is. Can I like open to death blow? Kill the ads. Ugh. <laughs> hmm. Now you leave. I wonder if I can sneak up on him. Heal. Dork. Okay. Um, where is all my stuff? I'm gonna think of what options we have. Let's go. I want to go talk to that lady again. I, we got that dried fruit. This one. You. You have. 
the no, dragon. I've died heart. too many times. Divine child. Yeah, yeah. Don't force yourself to speak. I, I don't know which way. <laughs> As you die, NPCs become infected and just. No, I can't talk to her until I heal her. Which I don't have the thing for currently. Mm. I got more, um... Let's go give the sculptor our monkey booze. Well, that's interesting, they're just both here now. No, I can't give you the the monkey booze. Another time, pal. Mm. Night. Thanks for hanging out. I'll be here getting shot in the face. Speaking of, maybe let's go try the the other guy. I'll be here. If I can get one more bead, then that will finish a necklace. And that will be helpful. Yeah, this guy. Okay. Right here. Yeah, he's also sneak out of Hello. Gonna be just as annoying, aren't you? have generally been going well, despite uh, the, the last five minutes. Uh, we found some new areas. There's a... a scarier snake eyes with some ads. So I want to try and beat this guy first. Maybe I can figure out what's going on. So he's gonna smack. And then that's that, and then if he hooks, then you can't block. Not that I can block anyway. big monkey friend to deal with too. I learned today that the director for Armored Core 6 is also the director for Sekiro. Neat. Oh, now I'm... Man, the man who coughs zealously sculpts... Oh, the him. The sculptor. Damn. Oh. 
Imposter Vor for mechs. I don't know how I feel about that yet. It's not. I was going to say you're going to have extra stuff, but I'm just going to get hit by that again. Nope. Hold on. That was rude. That was rude. They can break my umbrella guard. Mekiro? That's kind of brilliant. I want to get this guy, because in theory he's going to be one of our easier ones. Because he's just... Oh, well, actually, I don't know that's true. I don't know the comparative scaling in all the areas. Pleasantly surprised when I parry a bullet. <laughs>
come on. Res faster, res faster. So we skipped. We skipped the guy with the gigantic spear. That's the main one I can think of. I assume he's harder than this. And then there's our there's our um. Do you want to see our monkey friend? Let's do one more of these. These are if these are just an enemy type, then I need to figure them out. Okay. Well, I could do what about this is vitality taken from physical. Okay. Let's just do no. Just use it from here. Yeah. Oops. It's not bad. <laughs> Okay. You should just stay in this corner here. Easier than the other one, but Ugh. okay. Um, the thing that we sh should be doing is this ribbon cave.
Oh, I know where that is. Okay. That's the sneak cave. Right? No, that didn't have a waypoint. Petty cave. This is where our big friend is. Say hi to big friend. I was, I initially, we were at like three quarters of the way to a third skill point. So I was like, I don't want to waste it all fighting this guy. So I wasted it all fighting other guys. So, got nothing to lose now. But, we got a thing to help with all the poison bills. Yeah, there's a death. Wow. It's another grab. My God. Okay. Well. Gotta figure them out. We don't want to get hit by those because they poison. Is it? This posture meter is huge. out how to avoid that. He like breaks the tree. Oh right back into a horror loose situation. My favorite. Continuing the theme of bosses that are fine, except for that one attack that can kill you. When he goes for the grab, we just smack him. And we don't need our umbrella. I was trying to. Worked. Except for the part where I got grabbed again. You just fart at me.
<laughs> My muscles are all tuned to Genichiro. Nope, I didn't do that time. I swear I hit him. doesn't work. Hmm, <laughs> okay, so what do we got? We got an axe, which is for shield, which isn't very helpful. We have a thing that can spin a person once. That's probably more useful than an umbrella, at least. I like to just do something. Um, well, there's the spear. Hmm... Fighter enemies struck by the spear may be dragged. Can also tear poorly fitting armor. Yeah. I am imagining we can't poison it. Or maybe it has a lot of poison resistance. Is my guess. Might be worth trying. Be convenient if he could be poisoned. You can grab the trees. Oop. That seems nice. I don't know that it actually poisoned him. His reach is too long. Too long. Now we're, we're just out of uh, emblems again. That's the thing. Like, I, I'm i okay with the having a maximum number of emblems per rest, but running out when you're trying to grind a boss like this is kind of frustrating. to do about that. 
you can jump? I wonder if you can get me while I'm jumping. I say you can't get me from by your head, but he can. Okay. Just gotta keep the pressure on, right? That that's all it is. Like that. No, I meant to jump. I meant to jump. I meant to jump. See that? I was just out of range. Yeah, he he totally farted. <laughs> <laughs> Poison monkey. Did you see all the monkeys with the guns? You haven't been here for the gun monkeys. Uh, can I get back up there? Easily. How did I... How was I up there? Anyway, there's monkeys with guns and swords now. <laughs> there we go. Don't give you much time.
is the answer. You just have to be good at it. I'm back. So hard. Okay. Oh, we so that one he can grab you out of it. Yeah, well, we got into him a little bit there. Getting from one end to the other. No, not the not the poison gas! Oh, oh boy! Well, you can't run this direction. That was the other grab. Can I interact with you? Oh no, he grabbed the sword? That got way worse, way fast. He's using his head to see still? Is that what's happening? No! No! No. 
That's not what I thought. Oh, come on, man. That's terror, even? Should I be doing... Guardian ape, you. I knew this boss, and so I knew there was a big monkey, and I knew everyone hated it. Didn't know why. Now I understand. hit him out of the grab specifically, I think you can... When you hit him enough, he goes into a owl phase. And I think if you get him to that point with the hit, then that'll knock him out of the grab. But I think a hit on its own won't do it. things. <laughs> I'm like, at a loss for the things that I've already done, but now I'm like thinking of the second thing. go for like 10 more minutes so i'm just gonna keep doing this i guess i want to figure him out i do i want to finish another necklace but maybe that's the next time thing monkey friend
the what is um What is the the Horaloo Grabomania mech going to look like? Because there's gonna be one. This archetype, whatever you call this archetype of a boss, is gonna is gonna show up, right? Got a couple chains. He's got the grab. You can hit him enough. He goes into a vulnerable phase, and then after the vulnerable phase, yes, yes. He does the lunging grab. The jumping doesn't do anything for. Her. Yep. And that, and just straight up hit me with it. Come here. That one killed me? Wow. Okay. You say so. Fails. can't you can't run you can't get out of range you need to be right in his face the whole time Back here. Nope, that's not. Not exactly what I meant.
so much freaking help. him but I also hate him okay we'll do we'll do one more we'll do one more where we just don't get hit. Aside from the farts farts don't count maybe there's Instead of to the top. because my dream was not fast enough. Now he's dangerous. Not fine. Not fine. <sighs> One more. <laughs> Every time I expect him to open with the grab, he just Max me instead. It's a tough combo to block. The the backhand, the second one, has no no wind up to it, it's just in your face. <laughs> that one doesn't count. <laughs>
grab. Doesn't have actual hits. I'll get a red back, right? You know your tricks. I wonder if confetti helps here. I'm gonna pop a confetti, because we found some more. I'm curious if it does anything. to heal and that was not the good time. That'll be fun to deal with next time. Monkey. Monkey, monkey. Um, yeah, I think we're going to wrap up there. Because <laughs> that's going to be a whole thing. 
maybe we'll we'll go around next time and try to try to finish a a, a bead necklace and see if that'll help us. Um, maybe it will. Maybe it won't. Maybe we'll just get owned forever by a monkey. And guys with guns. Oh, the guns. Don't like the guns. And the monkeys with the guns, because of course. Anyway, that was some more Sekiro. We beat Genichiro. Genichiro. So that was cool. Um, that was the main thing I wanted to do. I just don't, didn't want to spend three hours fighting that one guy. And we got it. Um, so I'm proud. But now we have other things that are scarier, probably. Actually, no, this is like, this was locked behind that, so this is definitely higher level stuff. Anyway, um, I will be back for more Dwarf Fortress on Monday, and then on Thursday, and then we'll be back to more Sekiro on Saturday. So drop by if you want to see that, or check the VODs on YouTube. They're all going up there, whether they're broken or not. And yeah, uh, stay kind.